So YouTube ads right now, uh, it shows up, sometimes your videos are showing up a lot of display channels. And honestly, the power in YouTube ads is showing up on the YouTube videos themselves. So this is very simple way of excluding this traffic. And it comes down to having this one thing, Google AdSense underscore without underscore YouTube.com. You add that as an exclusion in your campaigns, you should not be seeing display traffic. Now, if you do this after you start getting display traffic, it's gonna take a while. It may take a few hours before it stops doing it. So you wanna probably do this in the beginning when you're setting up your campaigns. Now, I'm gonna show you how to do it on Google Ads Editor, and I'm gonna show you how to do it from your, uh, the Google Ads interface. So if you want to exclude it from Google, you go back to the search panel and you type in placement. And here you have placement negatives. You select that and you add the negative placement. So if we're looking for the negative placement, uh, the placement you wanna add is Google AdSense without YouTube.com. Select it, copy, and here add negative placement. You can add this at the ad group level, campaign level, whatever you feel comfortable. I like doing that at campaign level. In negative placement on the right pane, paste it and enter. And you have now excluded display traffic. Now we're gonna try to exclude it from the interface. So I'm already inside the account. I'm in the ad group level where I wanna exclude it. So you wanna to go to content. You want to go to placements, click on exclusions. Make sure from the drop down you select placement exclusions and you wanna have Google AdSense without YouTube.com. Select it, copy it, go back to the interface, click on the pencil icon, exclude placements. And here you can exclude from the campaign level or the ad group level. I would just go ahead and exclude it from the campaign level. You wanna go where it says enter and it says enter multiple placements. You right click, you paste and it says add one placement, you add it, save, and there you go. You see Google AdSense without YouTube.com. It's excluded. It's a site. That's how Google considers it at the campaign level. So you don't have to include it in multiple ad groups. And that's it. That's how you exclude display traffic. Now I will say this. Usually if, you're, if your campaigns start out showing up on YouTube channels and they end up going to display traffic, it's Google's way of telling you that, hey, I don't think I can get you the conversions that you're looking for on our in-stream videos. So that's something to think about. It's more likely to happen once you're not targeting contextually. Contextually is keyword, uh, topic, placement targeting. You're basically saying, I want to be here. Behavioral is using in the market, some custom segments, things of that nature, where they're really looking at the user, not the content of the video. In those cases, it's more likely to go to display traffic. But having said that, more times than not, when that happens, if you're not getting conversions, you're gonna start seeing more display traffic, it's because you still have work to do in either your video or your funnel. Now, if you wanna to continue to see uh, more free tutorials, check out our videos, we have tons of them. If you want something more in depth, you wanna find out if we can take it to the next level when it comes to YouTube ads buying, uh, please feel free, book a call, click on the link, it's totally free, and hopefully we can help you out.